In this video, I'm gonna review this AirPods 2 and share my thoughts about if you should buy AirPods 2 in 2020. Hey what's up everyone, welcome back to Tech Trends. If you're new here, don't forget to subscribe and click the bell icon so you won't miss any future videos. AirPods has been out since 2016 and they're the most popular headphones in the world since then. In March of 2019, Apple released the second generation of AirPods. I've been using this AirPods 2 for almost a year now and I use them every day. If you have an iPhone and thinking if you should buy the AirPods 2 in 2020, here's what I think about it. First of all, the price. You can get AirPods in two variations. One comes with wireless charging case, which costs $199 and the other one doesn't come with a wireless charging case and that's priced at $159 USD. I'm using the one with non-charging case because it's cheaper and the wireless one was out of stock when I bought it. Design-wise they look and feel exactly the same as first generation AirPods. But on the inside, Apple added a new H1 chip in this second generation AirPod. This H1 chip will allow the AirPods to reduce audio latency and connect to your Apple device faster. It also supports Apple's new feature automatic switching. What automatic switching does is it automatically switches between your devices that are paired to the same iCloud account. So if you're listening to music on your phone but switch over to watching a video on your MacBook or iPad, your AirPods will seamlessly connect to the Mac or iPad. For this feature, you need to install the latest firmware on your AirPods. If you don't know how to update AirPods firmware, you can check out the video that's now showing up on the top right corner. Now the sound quality. This AirPods sounds really good. They probably sound a little better than the first gen AirPods and I really like how they sound. This AirPods also support Hey Siri which the first gen AirPods didn't support. And the battery life of these AirPods are really good. I get around 4 to 5 hours of battery life in a single charge. And if the battery life is low, I can just put them back in the charging case for 10 to 15 minutes and get another 3 to 4 hours of battery life. It's just great. So should you get AirPods 2 in 2020 if you have an iPhone? Absolutely. I think these headphones are awesome and it's totally worth buying in 2020. But if you can spend a little more, I'll recommend getting the AirPods Pro. That one has better design and noise cancellation and more. I'll leave the link to buy AirPods 2 and the AirPods Pro at the lowest price available in the description below. If you wanna support this channel, you can use my affiliate links from the description below. Hope this video helped you. Like the video if you liked it, dislike if you didn't. Subscribe to the channel for more videos like this. Have a great day and peace.